What's up, guys? Today, we're talking about tri-rail uh, cab cars in the new scheme and some locomotives that are in the new scheme. I only have the pictures right here of the Bombardier bi-level cab cars since they are probably more godly than the BL36s and the Rotoms. BL36s are, are pretty good. Some can get foul, but Rotoms just suck. I just don't like their horns. And I heard that, the, and the seats are actually kind of stiff and rock solid compared to the ones in the Bombardier bi-level cab cars. But now, anyways, we'll talk about the cab cars that are in the new scheme. The ones that are in the new scheme are 503, the cab cars of Bombardier that are in the new scheme are 503, 505, 507, and 511. And finally, 507 gets a new scheme because in recent, in a few weeks ago, it was it was pulled out. It was... It, they took off his old wrap. It was the first tri row cap card to get the palm tree scheme. But now it just got it off. It took it off like a few weeks ago. When Super Batty 4th uh, uh, discovered it in the new scheme. Which I like. Which is awesome to see. It. 507 to be in the new scheme. Now. And hopefully it returns soon. Because... 507 doesn't have much reliability problems, doesn't have the damage that, doesn't have reliability problems like 503 had, did not have any damage that 511 had. And 511 is in the new scheme as well. What I find odd about the cap of 511 and 507's new scheme is that the numbers are low, like near the back and the front. Because if you look at 505 and 503's, there's in the middle. Like in the middle windows, which I find odd with 507 and 511. I wonder if they're, they're gonna make the full width cap cars have this look, or they're just gonna keep the when they're gonna have the the the, the ones near the middle windows and the in both ends of the ones for the 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 smaller the 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 pre cab ones of the UTDC ones. This fun fact: Tri Rail was not gonna be a, originally not gonna be a permanent commuter rail, but due to many people liking it, they just made it permanent and just gave you a new scheme. Instead of the paint, they just use wraps. Some of the people that I know said it was it would be aerodynamic, which is cool. Just like I like people saying it's aerodynamic, but it kind of kind of it kind of falls off eventually. Like how some can fall off pretty badly. Like Coaster 2301 and 2302's wraps fell badly, but only the fronts. But Tri Rail, if they keep them off for like a long time, like uh, like a lot of decades, they do, the sides come off. And 507 should come back cause, soon because it doesn't have reliability problems like 503 had. And did not have like damage like 511 had. 511's damage wasn't as bad as 510 or 509's. But it, it the only damage that I had is the plow. But the front, like the the side, like the sides, the windows, the front, was not like damage. It's just the plow that was just the problem. I hope 511 should come back soon. Wikipedia says 511 should come back in this year, and they say 509 is actually retired for uh to use uh, the sources the uh, part to use the source for parts to keep the other cabs up and cab cars up and running, but 509 uh, actually had its K5LA lost stolen by some unknown criminal, and. 510 had a horn once they fully repaired it in one picture with the Mark cap car, but it's, uh, it's it's gone. Like I don't know if try if it was damaged from the accident or I don't think it was damaged. So I think some criminal must have stole uh took it off. Whoever if they no one can find that. It's, no one can find that. But if someone did. They were if they actually did. They should keep put it back to 510. And catch a criminal and sentence them to like to a jail, like some theft crime. But I'm glad to see that 
5.11's in a new scheme and should be coming back soon. And I love 5.11's K5 LA. And it's going to retain it because 5.05 retained this K5 LA once it returned in a new scheme. And I hope, and 503 should return it, retain it, because Super Bowl 4 told me it will re retain it. So, that should be cool. Because the K5 that tri uh, 807 got, the F40, actually was uh, a, a K5 that a GP40 once had. And 507 should definitely keep it, re keep its K5 LA. So, if it comes back and it keeps the K5 LA, I love it more than ever, because I love 507's K5 LA. And hopefully, all the cap cars should be back. Hopefully, 509 should come back. Hopefully, some other cap cars that haven't been damaged, like 501, 502, 504, 506, and 508 should hopefully come back. Like, 508 actually lost one of its... Uh, Side strike recently, so hopefully it can get a new one once they rewrap it. But hopefully soon. 507 and uh, 501 don't have them used yet, but I hope five. I think 507 should get them soon because it doesn't seem to have much reliability problems. But what do you think of five of the try of the cap cards in the new scheme? Do you think it's awesome, or do you think you have better opinions about what cap? Uh, what are Opinions. Well, what other thing they should do to the cap cars? Or what co colors they could do? Okay, I'll see you in the next video. Bye, guys.